Papa Gunner here to talk nerdy to you about Marvel's Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur Season 2. The first time that I read Marvel's Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur, I was not super impressed, but I knew that it would be the perfect thing for kids, especially if it was animated, and I was 100% correct. Obviously, it's about this little girl, Moon Girl, I don't know, she's this genius and there's this dinosaur from this other dimension. The music's great, the animation is wonderful. I will say though that it doesn't really go over super well with a really young crowd. My oldest daughter is four and she likes it, but she's not super into it. The themes, the tone, it's really great. I enjoy it. I like it a lot. I think it's fantastic. It has a really good message. Message is. It had this really super intense cliffhanger at the end of season one that I was really happy and excited to get back into for season two. It does pick up exactly where it le leaves off. She's in this other dimension, but they fix that problem in one episode, which was kind of a bummer. But then there's reverberations from that one episode through the entire season that really work phenomenally. They work super well and was really well done and really well thought out. And I loved how they added Mel Var, and that was like her little nerdy male counterpart. Obviously, he's an alien. He, he's well used in this. It was really, that was cute having that back and forth. But just the things that she learns along the way, and then how that's used in the finale, how it kind of like comes full circle. That was so well done. But it also leaves it once again on another cliffhanger ending and leaves these other things that makes you go, I cannot wait to see season three because of certain things that are going on with Beyonder and her family. I I loved it. I enjoyed it. Had a good time. It was a blast. The kids still enjoyed it, but they didn't love it because it is for like a seven. It says Y7. So year seven and up, that's what it's for. I, I enjoyed it a lot. It was great use of Maria Hill. That was fantastic. Definitely like for me, I, because I enjoyed it so much. And I think if you have kids that are of that age, I would say it's a strong must see, must view, must stream. But for my kids, they weren't super into it. So so it's just like a regular like check it out but it's not like an absolutely you have to see it talk nerdy to me check out our merch at tntmtheshow.com the store our merch of the month is on sale with free shipping and that will mainly be avatar halo pokemon persona sega check it out and our charity for the month check that out on our instagram five percent of our profit will be going to that charity so help us help them thank you